going to elaborate more on, on Scala. So Scala is an acronym for Scalable Language, Scalable Language, and it's object-oriented, uh, and it's also functional. That means that uh, whenever you're programming in Scala, it's a lot easier to read than Java. Java is very uh, verbose and uh, it's very descriptive. So uh, Scala does use, uh, can use any of the, all of the Java libraries because it runs on the Java virtual machine. Um, here's an example of uh, how you would uh, code something in Java. So the, the this line, if there's a pair, integer and string, name P, um, and then you initialize, initialize it to one in Scala. Um, on the next line, we have a Scala example where all you have to use is the val um, keyword, P, and then the new uh, keyword, my pair, and then your, uh, your values. So the val is like a constant where it's uh, immutable. Um, you, can, you can change the value of that variable, but you can't uh, change the address that it's pointing to. Um, true or false? Scaling us on the uh, Java virtual machine. Yes, correct. Hello well, guys, I'm Amani, and I'm going to be talking to you guys about Python. So Python is an interpreted language. It's uh, 